In a nationally televised address, President Sabri Ramaphosa said that over the last seven days, South Africa has recorded an average of 7,500 daily infections with an increase in hospital admissions over the last 14 days and the average number of people who die from COVID-19 each day, increasing by 48% from 535 two weeks ago to 791 in the past seven days days. South Africa's seven-day rolling average of daily new cases has nearly doubled over the past two weeks from 6.69 new cases per 100,000 people on May 31st to 12.71 new cases per 100,000 people on June 14th, according to Johns Hopkins University. The nightly curfew has been extended by an hour from 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. while religious gatherings indoors are now limited to 50 people. The number of people allowed to gather for social events has been limited to 50 people for indoor events and 100 people for outdoor events. The retail sale of alcohol will only be permitted between 10 a.m. and 6 p.m. from Monday through Thursday. Doses of Pfizer vaccine are being used to inoculate people aged 60 and over. About 1.4 million people have received their first dose of the Pfizer vaccine. According to Ramaphosa, South Africa is expecting to receive 3.1 million Pfizer doses by the end of June.